this is my July Beauty Empties video. I've got quite a bit to go through and yeah, we are bringing the Beauty Empty videos back. Hi guys and welcome. I hope you are all doing fantastic today. Today's video, I am bringing back the Beauty Empties videos. Uh, so this is my July's Beauty Empties. Got quite a bit to go through. Um, I know I haven't done one in a while. Um, one was when my dog passed away. Um, I had one or two months off because of that with the MDs. Um, I went on holiday and just life in general got in the way. But we are back in the swing of it and the beauty MDs are definitely back and here to stay. Um, so yeah, I'm going to swing the camera around a little bit and we're going to go through this little box of goodness. If you have not already, if you want to hit that subscribe button, come on over and join my YouTube family. I would love to have you. Hit that notification bell as well. It will just let you know whenever I upload any videos. And of course, if you like this video, make sure to smash that thumbs up button. It helps my channel out so, so much. So, um, my usuals that are drawn in here, I'm going to go for this, that, and that. So, this is by the brand Sanex. Um, I go through at least one of these every month. Um, and yeah, it is the sensitive one. I really like it. It's a nice clean smell. Um, I just think it's very nice for under my arms. It's non-irritating for me. Hopefully it's non-irritating for you too, but I like it. Next is this. It is by Impulse and it is the Hint of Musk Body Spray. Um, again, I go through at least, at least one of these a month as well. And this one reminds me of my mum, so that is definitely here to stay forever. Of course, I have my Elizabeth Arden Sunflowers perfume. Uh, this is just a small one normally I have a big one normally it lasts me like a month and a half month possibly depending on how heavy-handed I am but yeah this is this is just a small one they didn't have any large ones in the shop when I went um but yeah love this perfume the scent sticks around for a while this is my everyday go-to perfume sticking with perfumes another one I love to use is this so this is Versace red jeans I love the smell of this it's absolutely gorgeous love it love it love it um and the scent on this one as well it sticks around for ages i just it's a, a nice sweet but it has a depth to it not very good at describing things but if you've smelled it you smelled it and i definitely love 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 this right so let's go with this one oh it's actually two uh so this is a shampoo and conditioner set by monday and this one is the smooth one. Um, I have done a video on this, so I'm not going to tell you if I liked it or not. Go check that video out. I've linked it at the top. I'll also link it in the description box and the comments. Go check it out and see my thoughts. If you've used this before as well, please comment down below and let me know what your thoughts are on it. Well, technically a non-beauty item, but I use it in my beauty room. It's just a little candle. Um, it's Let's have a look. It's Cinnamon Moon. It's the mini series English Picnic, 100% natural wax. This smells gorgeous, really, really nice. Just in a little tin, um, it looked nice while I had it out. And yeah, it smelled so beautiful. Um, would definitely love to have that again. I have this again. This is one of my regulars. I kind of have a few heat sprays that I like to use and I rotate between them. Um, but yeah, this is my Tresemme heat protectant and my hair seems to like it. So I like it. I have this. Um, so this is by the brand Bayless and Hardin. Um, and yeah, it is a really, really nice natural body wash um it is lavender and bergamot oh love a lavender scent and you can really pick up that bergamot scent in it as well gorgeous next i have this so this is by Herbert and it is a dry shampoo um, it's the volume and refresh dry shampoo i bought it to do a video which i did actually do i'll link it up top i'll also link it in the information box and the comment box give it a click because i'm not going to tell you what i think of it you have to see that video to see my thoughts on this um, but yeah, again, comment down below. Let me know your thoughts if you have tried this out as well. So we have this. It is by Grace Cole, England. And it is their luxurious body butter, um, vanilla, blush and peony 
this smelled absolutely gorgeous um very nice and i think the packaging's pretty I, yeah i loved everything about this it was so beautiful on my skin oh just noticed this one it is by the brand so and it is a body mist um and it's ibiza dreams this smelled so good so good really really enjoyed using it although it was only tiny um yeah not not bad i think i might have to try some of their other body spray misty things that they have because i've tried a few and love every single one so far next i have this by the brand nooks and this is a very rose three-in-one micellar water if you do not like the scent rose you're probably not gonna like this i don't mind it either way um and this was really really nice on my skin uh, again if my skin likes it i like it um it, it was all right it was okay to use we have this so this is by the brand new tree and it is a length extender hair mask made for hair that never grows past a certain length um again i've done a video on this i think this was gifted I think it was but i'll link the video here i'll link it in the information box and the comment box if you want to know my thoughts on it go check it out i do believe there's a link and a code on that video that will get you 20 percent off um but yeah check it out for yourself and if you've used it before comment below how did you get on with it i have a few makeup bits to chat about so first of all i have this so this is by ps primark special <laughs> and it's prep and protect uh, refreshing setting spray um i really liked using this really liked using this um very impressed that it was just a primark special um but would definitely get it again next we have this it is by essence and it is the stay all day 16 hour long lasting concealer uh, it was all right it was pleasant to use um if i had it again i wouldn't be upset um but yeah it was it was decent i have a highlighter here by beauty crop um and it was in the shade uh pear pressure this was a beautiful shade it oh my god the glow on your face was amazing this did not last me long at all because i when i fall in love with something i have to use it every time and like lots of it i probably used way too much each time when i used it but i don't care because i enjoyed it uh, this by charlotte tilsbury it was a lipstick um i think it was the yeah their pillow talk lipstick all gone all gone um very nice shade indeed really really liked it i really like the smell of it as well it smelled so beautiful then we have this by terry and it um was their powder wasn't it yeah um it's their colorless one that they do like a little setting powder um hydra powder it says on here um yeah it was really nice finely milled um it didn't look cakey on the skin um lovely i just wish it wasn't as expensive as it was i got this in one of the beauty boxes that i uh, unbox um i would like to use it again yeah. we have this by benefit and it is just their mascara it is their real mascara love it my favorite thing about it is the um brush the wand on it i love the way it separates the lashes um yeah one of, one of my favorite mascaras to use and then i think this is the last makeup bit that i have in here is this uh, so this is by rimmel and it is their lasting finish um foundation i got it in the shade 010 light porcelain i've done a video on this <laughs> i'm gonna link it up top there i'll link it in the information box and the comment box give it a click and see my thoughts on it i found another hair product here so this is by moroccan oil and yeah it is a moroccan oil treatment oil for all hair types guys it was only 10 mils in here but i tell you this lasted me such a long time such a little goes such a long way um i definitely need to get a larger bottle in this my hair loved it my ends of my hair loved it and they definitely need all the protection 
that they can get. <laughs> ah, right, yeah. So we have this one here, Spa by Spa Life. Um, and the pimple patches in a butterfly shape. I love pimple patches, absolutely love them, love going to sleep in them. But the only thing with these ones is because they were shaped like butterflies, when you'd pick them off the sheet to put them on your face, the wings would like curl up. So the time you put them on your face, then the wings weren't really sitting flat against the skin, um, which was a real shame, real, real shame. They do look pretty, but not practical. Yeah. We have this by Skin Therapy. Oh, I nearly dropped it. <laughs> uh, this is for tired looking skin. It's a brightening sheet mask with brightening and anti-aging vitamin C. Um, I love a face mask. Just slap it on your face, leave it. Well, you normally leave them on for 10, 20 minutes. This one's for 20 minutes. I just leave them on there for as long as the stick on my face. I normally put these on while I'm busy doing something, so I do forget about them. Um, but yeah, it, it was all right. Not the best quality of masks, I must say, but it was all right just to slap on your face for, for a bit of a tension on your face. But yeah, it was okay. So yeah, I got this. So I got this in one of the beauty boxes. Um, and um, is it by, oh yeah, it's by the brand I Want You Naked. Um, and it's anti-aging eye therapy. So you got three little vials in there. Um, and I really, really like them. They're really, really nice. I don't think it really had any anti-aging effects on me, but it was nice and hydrating under the eyes. Um, I didn't find that it plumped my wrinkles out or anything. Um, but I, I, yeah, I did like how hydrated my eyes were. Um, and each bottle, I think it says, where is it? I don't know where I... I don't know where I saw it now, um, but, but I think it said there's like two or three uses in each vial. Totally wrong. I got way, way more than, than... How many uses did I get? I should have counted. I must have got at least 10 uses from each vial. So we have this. So this is by OW, which is Organic Works. Um, and it is their Daily Bliss Moisturiser. Um, yeah, it was nice. Um, I mean, my skin seemed to like it. I didn't find it very exciting to eat, although it's skincare, but with some skincare, I get really excited to put it on and, and so on. I didn't really get excited with this one, but there was, there was nothing wrong with it. There was just nothing wowing me about it. Um, it, it was pleasant enough. We have this by Clarins Paris and this is their Rose Luminate. It's a multi-intensive um, radiance cream and yeah again if you do not like the scent of rose you're not going to like this. Um, it's a lovely bright pink colour. Was it a bright pink? It was some pinky colour in any way um, and yeah very very nice. It did it says yeah instant glow lifting and replenishing definitely had my skin glowing. We've got some face washes here so we have the Cetaphil oil skin cleanser and then we have the By B um, Clarity Cleanse Daily Gel Cleanser. Um, this one, when I'm having a sensitive day with my skin, this is what I use because it doesn't irritate it um, any further, which is great. This one was quite nice. I can't actually remember it, if I'm honest. I think it was nice. I can't remember it not liking it. Uh, yeah, very, very lemony smell. So here I have a product by Emma Hardy and it is the Brilliance Facial Oil. Love it. Absolutely love it. It melted into the skin gorgeously, left a beautiful glow, um, smells typical Emma Hardy. Uh, yeah, I want more, need more. We have this by Balance Me. It is the Collagen Boost Moisturiser. Really nice on the skin. My skin really loves this. Um, I don't think it particularly did anything for my many wrinkles. <laughs> Um, but very hydrating and gentle on my skin in any way. Last two products. So we have this by, oh, there's a hair. <laughs> we have this by Elemis. Um, and this is their Pro Collagen Marine Cream. Love it. Typical Elemis smell. Smells gorgeous. Beautiful on the skin. Oh, I want this by the bucket full just to dip my face in every day. And the very last thing we have is this. So this is by the brand uh, Verso Skincare um, and it is their nourishing cream with niacinamide. Yeah, really nice. 
very nice on the skin i must say um i wish it was bigger than what it was <laughs> right, guys so this is my july beauty mds and when i see it like that i think oh my god i didn't think it was that much but there's quite a chunk of products here uh, really glad i managed to get through them uh, one thing i would like to improve just by looking at this is face mask i want to see more face masks in here um but overall i think i did pretty decently give myself a pat on the back <laughs> um yeah comment down below are there any products here that you love using yourself are there any products here that you hate using um i've got nothing particularly bad to report on i don't think there i don't think so i don't think there was anything negative was there um but yeah that concludes this video guys so if you have not already hit that subscribe button smash that thumbs up button and i'll see you in the next one bye